Sometimes I feel the Spirit of God in the temple while reading the scriptures or while praying, but sometimes when the load is too heavy, I'm prompted to ask God, where is God? Why does he not stretch forth his hands as he did in the ancient times? One night when I tried uh, to seek comfort from a picture of Jesus Christ, I looked at the portrait of the Savior and said, you are just a picture here, but you are more than a picture because you are the Son of God. Working with God transforms our nature to endure the oppositions of life. Another night, I pondered why I was sometimes happy and sometimes felt peace. When I woke up early the next morning, I read a compelling sentence in Doctrines and Covenants 36, section 101, which says, We may not find joy in this world, but in Jesus Christ our joy is full. So what is joy? The story of uh, President Brigham Young urging members to rejoice even during their hard times inspired me to write a poem about how we can find joy. The only thing that he knows is that we can find joy through our sorrows. Like the pioneers of the ancient day, we can still rejoice and pray. We can be free, we can be happy, even though how uncertain the road might be. As Paul said, who shall separate us from the love of Christ? Shall tribulation or a test? Shall death or misery? Shall pain or victory? Because his love is mightier than the waves of the sea, he asked us to serve our community. I know that Heavenly Father would provide us with multiple blessings if we follow his Son and his teachings. I know that he is praying. I know he knows what he is doing because he has loved us from the beginning. I know that you will make us free even from the wounds that we cannot see because he is our master, our true friend. He understands, he comprehends. The Holy Ghost will help us to know that communication with heaven will help us to grow. Brother and sisters, we can be happy like the pioneers of old. If our life is under hard circumstances, I know that if we center our peace in Jesus Christ, we can still find hope because the Holy Ghost is there, our true friend. will never leave us alone with our mistakes. I also testify that Jesus Christ is our best friend because he will tell us who, re who we really are. In the name of Jesus Christ, amen.